You must remember me, Wanda. Lilith is only using you. Great composure, Magic. great deal about Wanda, but now I finally see her power with my own eyes. You need it more than I do. I am impressed. See, I am not the only one with a darker side. Your suffering begins. from this Scarlet Witch. It almost reminds me of my mother.
not the ones you should be worried about. You don't understand her purpose. Here comes a few more. Fixated on me. Their standards for leadership are low. I will bring you into the light. Your time has come. No escape. It would seem Lilith chose poorly. The darkness flows from spirit victory at best. Please, we don't want to hurt you. Hurt me. Hurt me. You will never hurt me again! <laughs> Giving up again. <laughs> of course you are. It's what you're best at, Ileana. I am not giving up on you, Wanda. None of us have. None of us ever will. Save your lies for Agatha.
don't know what state Wanda's in just yet. <laughs> Easy there. You are safe now. I'm not going to hurt you. But what if I hurt you? You do not want to hurt anyone. I don't. But I did. I... I, I wanted to. Wanda, you are back at the Abbey. With your friends. <sighs> Wanda. I know we have met before, but they call me the Hunter. Sorry, I... I don't feel like myself. I cannot imagine what you have been through. You will probably feel like yourself again after a good night's sleep. How can I sleep? The things I... did... Lilith made you do those things. They were not your will. But it felt like my will. Until you. You were the one who absorbed the darkness from me, weren't you? You brought me back. I did. How are you still standing? Okay, enough with the third degree. I know what we should do. Celebrate. Celebrate what? Your return, duh! I'm sorry, Nico, but I'm tired. I should probably get some sleep. Ugh, it's been a long time since I've slept. Yes, you should rest. We will talk in the morning. Love you, Wanda. Love you too. You did well back there, Hunter. Banner really let his inner Basquiat loose on those walls. I can't say I'd purchase it for more than ten grand. Your armor is quite incredible. Oh, thanks. I also make an amazing grilled cheese. <laughs> oh, I wish I could see Banner's face when he realizes we swiped this thing back from him. Do you think I'll get a curse you, Stark? Fist shaking in the air. It's kind of cliche, I know, but I'd still love it. I do not care for theatrics, but I do hope you get your wish. Oh, yeah. Could you picture it? Banner, standing there in the empty spot where this accelerator used to be, realizing Tony Stark got him good? I will leave you to enjoy your prize, Tony. Thanks. I just gotta figure out the best way to get this thing into the forge. Gonna be up all night with this bit. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for Wanda tonight. Did you just say thank you, Ileana? You lifted the curse your mother shrouded her in. But now, for the hard work. What do you mean? Scarred flesh heals more quickly than a scarred soul. It will take her a long time to recover from this. If she ever does. I don't know if I've recovered from my traumas. Not fully, at least. All Wanda needs is our love and patience. <laughs> love, patience. Sometimes love is not all you need. Sometimes it's revenge, redemption, victory. Sometimes it's crushing your enemy's skull beneath your boot and hearing the bones snap. What she must have gone through, we can only imagine in our worst nightmares. Not even the horrors of my childhood in limbo probably compare. And you've heard some of those stories. <sighs> okay. I said my thank you. Good night, Hunter. Be well. Oh, you freaking did it, Hunt! You brought her back and you didn't totally screw it up. I hope you know. What you did tonight means a lot to me and the rest of the Midnight Suns. You, uh, reunited our twisted little family of outcasts and, um... We're never going to forget it. Caretaker will not forget it either. You're not really worried about Fallout with her, are you? I am. Well, don't. Wanda's back. Everything is going to be better around here now. Just wait and see. We must treat the demon child army with the... Uh I think I'm in a bit of shock. Wanda? Well, yes, of course, Wanda. I 
can't believe she's standing here in the Abbey among us again. I wish I could have joined you at the lab to be part of the homecoming, rather than merely bystander. No matter who did the rescuing, the fact is that Wanda is back. And that is a good thing. Yes, yes, uh, you're right, of course, we should celebrate every victory. And thanks to you, my pity party was small. Had just a single guest. Me. I think the wisest thing would be for all of us to get some rest. We can assess the situation with clear eyes tomorrow. All right, then I guess I bid you good night. Good night to you. I thought I'd seen it all. I am a complete and utter fool. How so? Before you left, I warned you not to show Wanda any mercy. And what did you do? You not only showed her mercy, you brought her back with you. I don't know what to say. You do not need to say anything. Wanda is back with us. The corruption has been removed. We should just move on from here. That's what I'm afraid of. What if I can't move on? I thought when Wanda fell to Lilith, that would be it. I'd never see her again. I thought her fall was inevitable. I just keep thinking about what might have happened if I hadn't pushed her away. You cannot spend your time dwelling on mistakes. What is past is past. Then I suppose I'll reserve all my worrying about the future. That should keep me quite occupied. Is there anything I can do for you? Yes. Give me time alone to think. That's probably the wisest move for all of us. The bad witch is once again the good witch. The miracle worker arrived. I did not think you had it in you, child. Pulling your fallen comrade from the foul clutches of your twisted mother. You must be so proud. I know you are angry, mother. But if my spell could save Wanda, perhaps it could work on you as well. No spell can undo what was done to me, child. Besides, you did not save Wanda. You returned her to those who cast her away. Still, your actions were not without merit. I restored my friend. And yourself. We both know my energy cannot be purged. Bruce was right. There is only one possibility. You absorbed it, didn't you? There is no need to answer. I can feel it. As well as the new crack in your collar. How long do you think it will hold now? At last, the barriers between us are crumbling. Hunter, is that you? Do not bet on it, Mother. You've seen him, I can tell. You know about the temple. Oh, it's you. Hunter, right? Sorry for, um, last night. Well then, I hope you managed to get a restful sleep. You really think I could sleep after what I've been through? No, Hunter. I definitely did not get any rest last night. I just sat up and stared at the moon. Is it weird that I think she's going to be waiting for me in my dreams? You are not with her anymore. You are here, safe and sound. You need not fear her. <sighs> safe and sound? Seriously? 
We both know she's still got her claws sunk into me. I can feel them scratching. You may have taken me from her yesterday, but she still wants me by her side. Just like she wants you. <sighs> There's... Uh, something... Some... The moment you drained the darkness from me, I had a vision. What vision? The only way I can describe it was an ancient temple with tentacles etched in stone, reaching up and out like they wanted to strangle the world. I think it was the Temple of Cathan. It was just a premonition, Wanda. It does not mean it will come to pass. Something you should know about me. All my premonitions come to pass. Which is why you have to let me help you stop this one. Are you sure you are up to it? You do not need more time to rest and heal? You want to help me heal? Let me serve Lilith the revenge she deserves for what she did to me. What she did to us. Let me think about it. That's all I ask. I'm not as fragile as I look, you know. I'm up to it. I just want to make sure you are well, Wanda. I don't think I'm ever going to be well again. But I can make sure everyone else is. I'm talking your ear off, aren't I? I don't mean to keep you. Actually, I would like to know more about you. I would like that too. I want... Alright. Tell me your story, Wanda. My chaos magic came to me when I was a child in Transia, defending my father from a mob. I quickly learned how much humanity can fear what they don't understand. My twin brother had talents of his own. When the mob came for us, we fled and never looked back. We used our talents to survive, and eventually transcend our lot in life. But Pietro and I disagreed on how. Where is Pietro now? Still in Transia. He believes in a world where mobs don't menace children who are born different. I am not so optimistic. If he stayed in Transia, where did you go? All across Europe. I reinvented myself, lived a quiet life, and explored the limits of my magic. That's how Agatha found me. That's when I learned the source of my chaos magic. She offered to bring me here, so she could teach me how to refine it. <sighs> we had so many plans. Can you give me insight into your magic? Chaos magic is inherently dangerous, for it is the same power wielded by Cathan himself. It is magic forbidden to the Sorcerer Supreme, for its nature is unpredictable and its touch corrupts. But not for me. I leave no stain on reality, and I have used it effortlessly since childhood. I am the exception to the rule. Why is chaos magic so dangerous? If I desire it, I can alter reality itself, or destroy it. And despite what I believed, I can lose control. That's what happened with... with Agatha. Can we talk about your journal, detailing the Abbey's mysteries? Oh my. I'm so sorry. For what? Those were all notes to myself. I'm surprised they make any amount of sense. Well, they made sense to me. Your journals were the only reason I uncovered the Abbey's secrets. Really? That's wonderful to hear. I'm glad I could be of some use to the team, even when I was... away. I... Such a... What is it like to be an apprentice to Doctor Strange? I'm still getting used to it. After Agatha, I never thought anyone would trust me with magic again. A powerful wielder of chaos magic. Why indeed? That's not how I see myself. I don't know if I'll ever be more than a lost kid from Transia. I wasn't worth Agatha's attention, so why his? It sounds as though you do not want to be his apprentice. No! It's a great honor. I learned so much in such a short time. I just... I don't think I can live up to the idea of apprentice to the Sorcerer Supreme. Yes, Hunter? We shall... 
I look forward. Yes, Hunter? I don't think Caretaker wants me in the library. Are you certain? Oh yeah. She did that thing where she squinted at me, then cleared her throat about five times. I am very familiar with that. The library used to be my second home in the Abbey. I think it'll be good for me to be in there. But I don't want to push Sarah any further. Sarah cannot forbid you from doing your job. Testing her boundaries isn't something I want to do. I'm sure you understand. The Scarlet Witch needs access to books. Nobody sees it otherwise. I suppose. I'll swing by tomorrow. See if it's any better. One of my favorite activities. Well, don't get me wrong. I love the book. Read it cover to cover. Twice. Then I put it down and had a great night's sleep. Haven't had one of those since I came to this fun house. Is your bed uncomfortable? Oh, the bed is fine. It's all the other stuff that's been keeping me awake. Cold drafts, whispering voices, footsteps in the hall, footsteps on my ceiling, footsteps under my bed, footsteps on my bed, random stuff moving around. But last night, slept like a baby. All because I read the book and am starting to learn. Is it crazy that I'm actually kind of enjoying this? I am so glad you did not get spooked and run out of here. Facing the unknown can have that effect on people. I mean, I might have considered it. A couple times. But I'm glad I stuck around. Because of our friendship? Yep, that. And the fact that there was some kind of shadowy thing lurking in the hallway outside my room most nights. I didn't dare open that door. I will have to figure out your next lesson. It should probably involve some sort of artifact. The more ancient and forbidden, the better. I will see what I can do. Well, I can't express my thanks enough. You're taking all the spooky stuff and making it a little less spooky. Well, I guess you will have to come up with a new nickname for Strange, then. Oh no, he stays Dr. Spooky. I may be getting comfortable with all the oddities around the Abbey, but he still weirds me out. You and Strange are like two sides of the same coin. You know that? Yeah, I'm the scientifically engineered metal alloy coin, and he's the wish you make when you toss it in a well. I should probably put some thought into a suitable artifact for you to study. Oh sure, I'll be fine here. And if I see anything floaty and undead, I won't even yell. Hey boss, head to the forge. There's something you need to see. It's not strange in his pajamas, though... I will let you know if that happens. He has these matching slippers with curly toes. A real Santa's elf. Hey, uh, can I ask a favor? We've been through a lot as a team, but we've come a long way. The weird vibes around here are driving me. Of all the gamma accelerators I've seen in my life, this is definitely the gamma -ist. That was a hell of an operation. 
Snatch and grab, and a rescue. I score that a big win for everyone. Indeed, a much-needed victory on many levels. Today is the first in a long while I haven't awoken to see doom clouds gathering on the horizon. It's a refreshing change of pace. We successfully retrieved the Gamma Accelerator and brought Wanda home. No wonder your mood is lighter. I'm so glad we kept the Accelerator out of Lilith's hands. Although Tony's notion of stopping the prophecy is doomed to failure because the only thing that can stop Cathan is Cathan. But that's a worry for another day. Today is about optimism. Dark days will inevitably return, but I think you are wise to take a moment and appreciate the good things when we have them. Success follows failure. Failure follows success. It's circular. At this moment, we are at a crest. We bask in the warm feelings and pray we don't drown the next time we descend into failure. I would like to talk more, but there is still much for me to do. Too much, but I appreciate the time you gave me. Be well. I'm not sure... I can't tell you how great it feels to have the Gamma Accelerator back. Seriously, total game changer. You are well. But we can't start passing out the party favors quite yet. If we don't find Johnny Flame Top and grab the Parchment of Power, this thing is just a glorified barbecue lighter. Johnny Blaze is not nearly the threat to us Banner is. I suspect he will hand it over once he realizes we are the world's last hope. Oh yeah, he's been totally reasonable and thoughtful so far. And if we do get the Parchment, you really think you will be able to stop the prophecy? My appreciation of magic is evolving quite a bit thanks to you. It'll be tricky, but I think it's possible. Your overflowing confidence is something to behold, Tony. I wish I had some of it. I'll take all you want. I have enough confidence for the whole team. No matter what, though, this whole thing has already been completely worthwhile. Oh? And why is that? Because right now, I'm looking at the Gamma Accelerator, and Bruce Banner is looking at an empty spot where the Gamma Accelerator used to be. All we need now is the Parchment of Power. Looks like... Prophecy? Well, I prophesy you never. Why do I always have a flathead screwdriver when I need a Phillips head? Complex runic systems are at play here. Focus. Concentrate, Steven. Do not teleport Tony Stark to Kathmandu. Hey, Hunter. Hand to the way. Sometimes, I even impress myself. If this thing behind me turns into a giant gateway to ancient Egypt, I'm quitting. Later. Hunter, consider yourself the only invitee to my favorite meet time spot. The only one? How did I win that honor? I'll spare you the savvy stuff, but you've climbed to the top of my friendship ladder. Almost at the top. If I am almost at the top, then who is my competition? Someone? Y you don't know them. I've got a life outside of this place, you know? Sure you do. What is their name? It's... it's, uh... Okay, fine. It's you, all right? You've been the best friend I've had since I was on the run, and I feel gross saying that out loud. You do? Kinda. But that's a me gross and not a you gross. Could you just please change the subject before I sink through the floor? Of course. What are best friends for? Oh my god. I'm surprised your favorite spot is the chapel. 
Believe it or not, my family used to go to church religiously when I was a kid, so pretentious old buildings give me this comforting vibe. It wasn't always like this. What changed? Do I look like a psych major? But if I had to guess, I would say I needed to peel the rotten layers my dear mom left behind to get to my healthier innards. You know, onion style. And I took your advice and used a little of the good old magic to heal the trauma with my mom. Healing your soul is just as important as healing your body. One cannot function without the other. Yeah. That didn't click until you said it last time, but it made so much sense and it, it worked. Now, there is no holding me back, and like you've been there for me, I'll be there for you. When we face your mom one final time, I want you to know, I got your back. Whatever you need, I'm your witch.
Concentrate, Stephen. Do not teleport Tony Stark to Kathmandu. Why do I always have a flathead screwdriver when I need a Phillips head? Complex runic systems are at play here. Focus. Looks like Banner didn't tinker too much with the damn accelerator. Prophecy. More like prophecy you never. Strange is acting stranger than usual now that Wanda's back. Caretaker's not happy today. Ready to work? New and improved. Think that. Ready for more? Later. The weird vibes around here are driving me nuts. Any new leads? I'm not gonna sleep well. New energy in the Abbey today, Hunter. Hell yes, movie nights are back. Did the movie nights ever go away? I'll do you a favor, just this once. If we had some rookies, I'd say send them out for the experience. But I think we're past that. See you soon. You want in on this discussion, Hunter? Bye. Cap and I were just having some words about Tony. I hear a bit of hesitation in your voice. The thing is, I've seen Tony like this before. He becomes fixated on one idea to the exclusion of all others. Sometimes the results are great. He can split a molecule and make it rain in the Sahara. But considering the danger we're all in, we can't afford to have anything less than absolute perfection. Otherwise, I'm afraid too many people will die. I know the danger all too well, and I would say your concerns are valid. The question is, what to do about them? I don't want to completely derail the plan, but I do think it would be wise to have an alternative ready to go. Meaning? We need to start walking, talking, and planning as though this prophecy is going to come true. So what do you plan to do? Are you going to confront Tony? I'm not sure what that would accomplish. Our skepticism aside, no one wants this plan to work more than we do. We'll just have to cross our fingers and hope, like everyone else. Here's hoping Tony can pull this off. Wanda coming back shows you how flu- I understand you spoke to... Wanda this morning. Tell me. How is she faring? Perhaps you should ask her yourself. I am sure she would like to hear from you. I'm not ready for that. I can't imagine that she doesn't feel some semblance of betrayal on my part. I was the one who gave up on her, and long before she fell to Lilith. I just thought she was lost to us, beyond saving. No one has been purged of Lilith's corruption before. I didn't think it was possible. But you and Nico made it possible. This isn't easy for me to say, but... 
I'm sorry for ever doubting her. Admitting you were wrong is one of the bravest things we can do. Not as brave as you were last night. Not only did you defy me, but you defied Lilith. And won. I can't help but ask, what was it like, purging Wanda of Lilith's corruption? Did you suffer any strange effects I should know about? I did experience something you should know about. What's that? I had a vision. I believe it was the Temple of Cthon. No, that would mean... Cthon is almost upon us. Then we better get to work. Well, that's enough of me monopolizing your time for now. We'll talk more later. If Hydra's mystics succeed in opening that rift, they'll call even more of Lilith's children to their side. back when you're feeling stronger. had your chance to escape. No pain will take our loyalty. Leave not another mystic out of the ritual. You think you will fare any better? Yeah! 
Just what I needed. No, Fiend.
Garland. A feeble effort. for now. Hydra standards have fallen a great deal. You're getting pretty good at that. It's good to be back in the fight. Make this quick. We've done it. <laughs> 